Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Camp Blood Media. My name is Josh, and today I'll be reacting to Dylan's New Nightmare, a Nightmare on Elm Street fan film. Now this movie is a direct sequel to Wes Craven's New Nightmare, so that's pretty cool because it actually takes place in the real world like Wes Craven's New Nightmare does, and it even features the return of Miko Hughes from New Nightmare who played Nancy's child. So this is going to be a crazy cool movie. Alright guys, let's get into it. There's that classic score. Oh, there's Rex. It's been 25. That is like a perfect Rex replica. Unless Miko had his own. I think he does have his own. It's probably Miko's. In a mental prison with no means of escape. So this entity Nothing that was pretending to, do, to be Freddy must wait, be strong enough to come back. Watch. Trapped in the mine. Those pictures on the wall were a little off. Escaped the slaughter. They weren't lined up. Too weak to defeat the Guardian. Until now. Now it's time to have some fun. Oh. <laughs> Miko, you better watch out. <laughs> Miko! You can definitely tell it's him, too. That's so incredible they got him back. Like, how can you even call these fan films when they have the actual actors from the movies in them? Alright guys, well that was the trailer for Dylan's New Nightmare. I'm super excited to see this movie. New Nightmare is one of my favorites in the entire Nightmare franchise. I know some people don't necessarily like it because it takes place in the real world and isn't directly involved with the other six movies, but I really like the fact that Freddy is like trying to come through into the real world and the only way he can do it is to kill Heather who defeated him the first time. I'm kind of curious what's going to happen in this movie because Heather would probably still be around unless they're gonna like have her be dead for the the sake of the movie just so that Freddy has to come after Dylan specifically or maybe because Dylan was like the one he was trying to enter the real world kind of through maybe it's Dylan who he actually has to defeat and he was wrong about having to defeat Nancy in the last movie I'm not sure but it definitely looks very cool, so I'm excited to check it out. I actually just messaged them about picking up a Blu-ray for it, so hopefully they still have one. Alright guys, until the next one, have a good one.